Hi and welcome to everything about information technology today in this lesson we will talk about modern networking and SDN so let's start but before that please subscribe our channel. Modern networking brings new valuable features such as flexible packet forwarding, centralized management, vendor agnostic, analytics, disaggregation and integration with cloud and orchestration platforms. The current definition and the way SDN is positioned within the networking industry and the market is more or less a rip and replace model. However, this is not correct, as there are different ways to build an SDN network, such as rip and replace, direct fabric programming in this method, the networking gears need to be replaced with pure SDN enabled devices. An SDN controller cluster will manage the networking devices and integrate with other platforms such as virtualization. Examples Cisco ACI, Big Cloud Fabric from Big Switch Networks. In such a pure SDN network, which is controlled by an SDN controller, the forwarding tables of the networking devices are managed by the SDN controller via a protocol such as OpenFlow. The network devices do not run any routing protocol or make any decision for forwarding a packet or frame. Instead, the whole switch hardware tables are controlled by the SDN controller. Overlay this method works with SDN. Controllers that build an SDN overlay network on top of an existing legacy network. The underlying network is unaware of the overlay network. Examples. VMware NSX, OpenStack Neutron, Tungsten, Fabric, etc. Overlay SDN controllers are integrated with virtualization platforms such as VMware. Zine or OpenStack to build a virtual overlay network for virtual workloads to communicate with each other and with the outside world. The overlay networks use encapsulation protocols such as VXLAN to build virtual networks. Hybrid This model works with networking equipment that supports OpenFlow as an additional protocol within their software stack. For example, a switch may run BGP and OpenFlow. Together, allowing an SDN controller to override the packet forwarding tables of the networking device. Examples. OpenFlow enabled switches from Brocade, HP. Hybrid SDN brings together the value of both worlds, legacy networking and SDN, as it works with protocols such as OpenFlow and BGPPCEP. The impact of SDN and modern networking for service providers is more significant, as it can help a service provider implement a flexible traffic engineering policy at the core backbone network. This allows the core network to forward the traffic in a way the service provider wants, instead of the way that the routing protocol dictates. Thanks for watching. Please do not forget to subscribe our channel.